Well, it took some major digging, but I got my first Creek Civil War mini ball. That's pretty darn cool. There's a little kayak. That's awesome. Thank you, Lord. I just got my second bullet. This is a 69. It's fired. I just got another 69 caliber round ball. It's raining just a little bit. I'll wait till this little storm passes. Lay here and maybe take a nap. Well, the rain has stopped and I got myself another little mini ball. Fired, I think, yeah. Another big 69. I can't show you underwater because it's just so, so muddy. I mean, you don't have any visibility. I'm just feeling with the pinpointer. Keep looking. Well, this took a long time of digging, but it's a nice, big 69, 69 caliber. I got a big old horse fly buzzing me. I keep on digging. All right, I thought I'd show what I've got so far. That turned out to be a little honey hole, because these six bullets came out of that one little hole in the rocks. And there might be another small bullet in there, but I think I, I dug for a long time and can't seem to get to it. So it might just be a little lead ball. Anyway, so these came from that one hole. I got chicken skin. This is all the Civil War bullets I've dug so far. And then there's some weights, fishing weights and modern bullets. And I don't know what these things are. No idea. And it's really pretty out right now. The rain left. I'm going to keep working my way that direction for a while. Alright, this is what I ended up with today. Uh, that's all the fishing and unknown lead. Here's the shot bullets and small caliber rounds, large caliber, 69 round balls, and then there's uh, some 69 minis and 58s and maybe 54s, can't really tell. Uh, they've been tumbled in the river pretty good, I guess, that's what's going on. A lot of them are worn almost smooth, those guys right there. Some of them I really dinged getting them out of the rocks. But that's the way it goes. Guys here are pretty bad. You can see the rings on it. You can see it's a mini. And here's pretty smashed up. I got these things. These sounded really good in the water. They felt really good. Reaching down and feeling the rounded top. Not sure what they are. Don't know if they're Civil War or if they're bridge parts. Or wagon parts. Anyway, that's it. It's good night. Just dug another little. It's a 58. And uh, it's starting to get kind of late. I'll keep going for a little while. Well, it was a big kind of squished round ball. Kind of flattened, I guess, a shot. Another really well tumbled uh, 54 or 58 caliber mini ball. Oops, there it went in the water. Let's find it again.
So another decent little signal in the water. And just to show you how murky it is, I'll go under. I just got my very first Williams cleaner. That's pretty cool. Filled with rock, but that's what that is. I'm sure. I'm pretty sure. That is cool. It's my very first. Hope that's showing up. That is awesome. Now, I'll just hold it. Anyway, cool. Woohoo! Thank you, Lord. I had some big storms earlier. Some hard rain. Alright. This is what I got for the afternoon. Some really tumbled 69s and 58s, or maybe 54s, 58s, I think. And except for that one. I mean, some of these are really, really tumbled. But I'll take them anyway. Here's that Williams cleaner. I was really glad to get that. Come on, into focus. Well, let's just do it like this. There we go. It's kind of neat. I kind of like it with the rocks in them. Kind of cool. I'm just going to leave it like that. Some round balls and some small shot. I made sure I looked pretty hard for fishing sinkers. There weren't any in there. There's some fishing sinkers. No old ones. I think that's modern post-Civil War leads. Anyway, it was a pretty good afternoon. I was pretty excited. My daughter called and she's wanting uh, some money for some volleyball sneakers. I told her she's going to have to watch this video first. She's not too happy about that. Thanks for coming along.